let's talk about why you might consider a secondary PTZ camera to support your primary PTZ camera in your next conference room design. If the budget allows and the space is configured properly, that secondary PTZ camera lets QSIS perform a pretty cool sleight of hand, which can result in a far better experience for those remote participants. Let's take this room for example. Here we are in a fairly typical conference room. Let's have a listen to a conversation in progress from the far end. QSIS uses data from the ceiling microphone to trigger camera presets around the table so the far end can be in the action too. But if you only have a single camera, your far end endures a lot of camera motion. And after a certain point, you might as well stick with a wider angle, which after a while has its own problems. Here's where the magic of that secondary camera comes in. You can let your QSIS primary and secondary camera trade off between these preset angles. So if your primary camera is on this side of the table and someone on the other side of the table starts talking, your secondary camera gets into position and QSIS makes the switch from the far end automatically. The far end is blissfully unaware of how it happened and instead they're just enjoying the show. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.